on the one-mile paid track here at Milwaukee, the 200-mile race for championship cars. Your 10 top drivers, 92, Jimmy Clark, 1, Roger Ward, number 10, Chuck Hulse, 93, Dan Gurney, internationally known driver and builder, 2, A.J. Foyt, 4, Don Branson, 98, Parnelli Jones, 14, Roger McCluskey, 38, Jim Herdeby, well known as a charger, and 46, Johnny Rutherford, off the line with both front and rear engine cars in competition for 200 miles. The pace car heading for the apron. A good lineup. All cars in their proper position. The green flag is down and the race is on. Jimmy Clark in the 92 car takes the lead. Out of turn two, Dan Gurney has moved into second place in the 93 car. Down the back chute into turn number three, A.J. Foyt in car number two, running in third place. Into the main straightaway still, Clark, Gurney, and A.J. Foyt. As the rest of the field closes it up tight through turn one and into turn two. The leaders starting to stretch it out. Into turn three, Jimmy Clark the leader, and it's been a long time since any European driver has shown them the way around. Here are the first five spots in the lineup. 92, Jimmy Clark. 93, Dan Gurney. Number two, A.J. Foyt. Number one, Roger Ward. 10, Chuck Hulse. And the duel is on for second place, Gurney and A.J. Foyt. The rest of the pack holding it real tight all the way around. In turn number one, Al Miller spins, slams into the wall, sliding to a stop. He's clear and out of the way of traffic. The 45 car goes back to the pit with rear end damage. And the driver, Al Miller, is okay. The leader out of the turn, and the battle is still on with Gurney and Foyt for second place as they move through the slower car. Out of turn four, checking the speed. Gurney in car number 93 and Foyt in the two car, side by side, as they head into the back straightaway. Out of the turn, Dan Gurney still holds off the charge by A.J. Foyt in car number two. The first five positions, 92-year leader, Jimmy Clark. 93, Dan Gurney. Two, A.J. Foyt. Number one, Roger Ward. Car number 10, Chuck Hull. Clark moving through the field with ease in the rear engine car. Down the main straightaway, Gurney down on the pole. Foyt trying it on the outside. Into the back chute, Gurney in the 93 car holds him off. They're racing bumper to bumper, lap after lap. Clark through the turn all along. And Constantine loses it. Into the wall, backwards. Climbing out of the car and he appears okay. Out of the turn, Gurney and Foyt right together. What a tremendous race these two have put on here today. And it's not over yet. A.J. Foyt around the outside. Gurney in the 33 car is blocked. And A.J. Foyt in car number two takes over second place. In the main straight, Foyt in car number two starting to pull away. He's after the leader, Jimmy Clark, in car number 92. And the crowd is with him all the way. The rundown with only five more laps to go. 92, Jimmy Clark. Two, A.J. Foyt. 93, Dan Gurney. Number one, Roger Ward. And 10, Chuck Huff. Jimmy Clark in the 92 car in turn three laps Roger Ward down on the inside. A.J. Foyt powering through the turn, trying to catch the 92 car. Gurney out of the turn through traffic, hanging on to spot number three. 
Roger Ward having his troubles here today is also mounted by Dan Gurney. Here's the leader, car number 92 on the last lap, down the back straightaway, followed by the two cars. And down for the checkered flag. The winner is car number 92, Jimmy Clark. And a very happy little Scotsman pulls into the winner's circle.